Daniel's been in the league for uh, a number of years now, and he's obviously one of the best point guards in the league. So, um, you know, as a rookie, I'm just trying to learn as much as I can from both those guys and uh, kind of come in and um, provide that spark off the bench when I can. How have your expectations of what the league was going to be like? Are you sort of meeting what you expected? Yeah, uh, you know, it's like I said, it's kind of been an adjustment from uh, the college system and a diff kind of a different role for me. But um, yeah, I, I mean, I think that I've been doing a good job. You know, the league's very good. Um, so uh, yeah, I'm just kind of trying to take every day and get better and uh, wait for my opportunity. The team being 11 and 1 at the moment, I don't imagine you would have. Uh even dreamt of that at the start of the season. Yeah. You know, we knew we had a special team, especially after the blitz. We can kind of gauge where we were at. But uh, yeah, you know, this, this is a, obviously a really good start, and we're just trying to keep it going through, throughout the year. How good would it be to get one more win over New Zealand to go to that break at 12-1? Huge, yeah. Like, like I said, you know, we're really trying to get some momentum right now. So um, it would be huge for us for morale and uh, momentum and everything. So Is the break going to be needed? Are you like? You know, halfway through the season, the guy's getting a bit sore and tired. And that's yeah, definitely. I think it's good for, uh, you know, <clears throat> as wearing as it is physically, it's also kind of a mental break for us. Uh, guys like James and myself can kind of go home and, and meet with family for a week, and uh, we can all kind of get some rest. I know Jermaine's kind of got some bumps and bruises, so uh, the time's kind of a it's, kind of, it's good to kind of be able to rest and uh, both mentally and physically. I think a few of you, you are going back to America, aren't you, for a few yeah. days? Yeah. Um, how long do you sort of get away and that sort of thing? Uh, we get about six or seven days, so uh, Coach is nice enough to kind of give us that break and opportunity to head home if we wanted to. So I'm looking forward to kind of being able to pick up some more clothes and stuff that I left behind back in August. So uh, but it'll, it'll be great to kind of see family and be home for the holidays. So. so where's that? Do you go back and stay with your parents at California? Yeah, California. I'll fly back to San Francisco and then I'm from Sacramento. So I uh, drive back to Sac and kind of hang with some family and friends for, for a week. Catch any Kings games? Or yeah, <laughs> that's the plan, you know. Uh, Sunday, I think they play the Rockets or something. So i uh, try and get tickets to that and uh, yeah, watch the future NBA champs this year. So. <laughs> what about uh, New Zealand this season? Um, they. They look a lot better now than, than what they were at the start of the year. Yeah, definitely. They're a completely different team than when we played them back in, I think, October and November. Um, we got a new import and he's playing really well with them. Uh, and you can kind of just see it based on Friday night. Their, their chemistry is a lot better than it was at the beginning of the year. So we know that they're a championship caliber team and um, they're kind of going to continue getting better as the season goes on. So I wasn't really surprised, but um, yeah, they're, they're a very good team. You've obviously only been there once, but it's always pretty tough to go to Auckland and get a win. What are the sort of secrets to, to going there and getting that result? Yeah, you know, I mean, Will does a good job of uh, making sure we're hydrated and uh, doing recovery on the road and get, uh, getting some rest. So it's a good chance for us to kind of uh, get some sleep on the, on the planes and long plane rides and catch up on some TV shows and whatnot. So. Is that one of the toughest places you've been so far, going to Auckland? Yeah, I think so. It's definitely, I mean, you're making quite a trek. You have to fly across the country and then from there go to New Zealand. So it's definitely the longest road trip uh, we make, but, um, you know, it's part of, the, part of the job. And physically yourself, are you feeling pretty good at the moment? Yeah, I'm feeling really good. Uh, I think I'm probably in the best shape that I've ever been in. So uh, just, again, just trying to learn and, um, as much as I can right now as a rookie and kind of wait that opportunity to get on the court.